on, on, on the Rock and Rap show. Brother's going to work it out. Hey, man, how was your day, Yes, sir. Chief? Yes, sir. How was your day, Chief? Talk to you. Oh, man. Oh, uh, shit, man. My day was like uh, a honeymoon uh, down there under the bridge with the homeless. Dang. <laughs> That's hard. That's harder than finding a job with babysitting the benefits. Hey, yeah. man. Hey. Hey. What's up? You remember, remember, remember what I was telling you earlier? We right. may have to do that, man, because uh, I told you I'd be hearing that. Uh, you know what? It sounds pretty clear. A a anybody in the chat room, do y'all hear feedback for the number one chief rocker? Or does it sound pretty good? Yeah, the sound check, sound check. My mic sound right, check one. My mic sound right, check two. Hey, it sound pretty good. Hey, man, somebody say something. You know the background listeners let us know. Somebody say low key, we got low key and Sabrina in the uh, chat room. You know, they'll, they'll tell us right off, man. They actually like us for whatever reason that is. Yeah, well, I told you. I told you. She said echo. So we got to go to the other one. Yeah, we got to go to the other one. Yeah. You know what? Let the Chief Rocker hang up. We finna, uh, technical difficulties. Chief Rocker gonna call back on the other, on the back phone in a second, man. Uh, uh, and while he do that, I'm gonna announce who in the chat room and thank y'all for, for the support. Much love and thank y'all for the support. Thank you, thank you. Again, this is the second episode of No One Chief Rocker and H Rap B show called Brothers Gonna Work It Out. Hey, y'all, how this sound now? Does that sound better, everybody? Does Chief sound better, y'all? Kaboom, kaboom, kaboom. Yeah, that the first one was choppy. Now uh, it should be better now, but I I don't hear the choppiness in, in my background, you know. Oh, okay. So um, yeah, we we, we should, should be, be good. good. Oh, they say you clear uh, now. Uh, All right, well you clear yeah, now. Man. It's the number one Chief Rock and H Rock B. Brothers gonna work it out. Exactly, exactly. And they say you kind of low, Chief. You gotta turn your volume up, big dog. You gotta turn your volume up. My, my volume is up. You gotta turn yours up. Mine is up sky high, bro. They say you low. This guy, I'm low. Yeah. Man. They say you ain't up high no more. They say you down low. <laughs> I got you out. I didn't even got you sitting on top of my mic. So, would you know what, man? They say you distant, but they can still hear the number one chief rocker. So, we're going to get this show on the road, man. Let's acknowledge the people who came in, man. We really appreciate all the background listeners. Big up to the background listeners. And I got to give myself a boo. Sit your ass down. Sit your ass down. Because, man, I made a mistake and put the wrong damn Avi up. That is, that's my show, Abby. Not, not, that's not the Ace Rap and the uh, uh, Chief Rocker, Abby. My bad on that one, Chief. My bad, for real. But. Well, you know, uh, well, you know, last week was we the first show. This week is the second show. You normally go through a little technical difficulties, you know what I'm saying? Especially if um, you haven't really worked it out beforehand, you know. Uh, We're going to find time, you know, throughout the weekend and, and early next week. To make everything happen, we're gonna do some test runs. So then, you know, we don't have to worry about that. But you know what? It's about that ghetto love. If you were born and yeah. raised in the ghetto, you gonna get a little ghetto. That's what's up. <laughs> exactly. And I want to thank everybody yeah, for sharing the show. I need everybody to again hit the like button, hit the share button, and the background listeners. Big ups to y'all for being background listeners. We really appreciate y'all for coming in and joining the brothers. That's gonna work it out. What's that? Tell the person next to you to turn their damn phone or radio on, computer on, and tell them to hit the show so that we know. <laughs> exactly. We need as many people. We poll around here. We trying to get listeners and, and sponsorship. Chief Rock already working on that Ciroc. 
I'm finna start working on Boom Farm because I'm from the hood. Chief Rock and High Class. I, I, I'm working on Boom Farm and Mad Dog 2020. I ain't that much high class. I had a 42-ounce Old English last week, man. I ain't had that shit in about 30-some-odd years, man. Damn, yeah, About 30-some-odd years. You yeah. digging deep. You know, I, I fucked around with that old eight, boy. That shit, charcoal bro. <laughs> hey, boy, you you a grown-ass <laughs> man, like Chief. <laughs> you a grown-ass yeah. man, Chief. You run around here drinking Old English, man. Damn. Hey, man, shit, I mean, you, I mean, you ain't got this certain age to drink this shit. You know what I'm saying? If you're used to drinking, I mean, you know, you go back in your roots sometimes. I went back to my roots. And oh, I went got me one. You know? I, I, hey, I'm stay out of my roots. I don't, don't want to drink that much. You can have that one. Hey, man, but uh, before we get started, Chief, let me acknowledge the folks that came in. First and foremost, first person in the room, I think it was my main man, DJ Chuck. Chuck at work. He tuning in. Big ups to Chuck for tuning in. It reaches respect. And then hit that IV if you don't already follow Chuck so he can get subscribers, so he can blow up with us. Then we got our man, DJ Knox, who rocks the box, the dopest DJ, east of the Mississippi River. He holding it down for the dope city of New Jersey. What's good? Right, and if y'all didn't know, DJ Tuck from Chicago. Go ill in the building. That's all I got. That's all I got to say, man. Go ill in the building. I got it. DJ LT from the MCDE. She the team leader. Hit that Abby and follow her. She gonna have some dope tunes for you too. What's up? <laughs> and I got my girl Low Key in the building. She holding it down from California. Knows how to party. What's up, Low Key? I drink low key up uh, under the porch. You know, Not even the table. Who is that? Oh, that must be Denise Milk and Cookies in the bed. And then I got from the door. I got from the glorious state of Indiana, Sabrina Looney in the uh -huh. building, born on the west side of Chicago. She ain't, she wasn't born on the west side. She's born out west. You got to, if you're from Chicago, you got to say you're born out west. Out west. Okay. Out west. Yeah. Out west. Presently residing in the great state of Georgia, formerly from the great state of Michigan. He's a big time Detroit fan all across the board. And if I hit that follow, Abby, on my man Jelani, he in the building. What's good, Jelani? Thanks for the follow, bro. Oh yeah, we I almost forgot about Lopan, indeed. And I got my main man, Big Illinois, from the lower north side of Chicago, or as we say, up north. Big Illinois in the building. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, you met the man got all his Easter clothes on. He from out south. <laughs> One of the coolest brothers you'll ever meet. He goes by the name of Chris. Chris Reinhardt. He in the building. <laughs> he got his Easter suit on, man. The man in here trying to pick up a girl or something, Chief. Oh, okay. Okay, shit. Uh, damn. Uh, <laughs> shit, it's the middle of summertime, man. Shit. You should be able to go and get you, put you on a white beat and uh, pair of nice goddamn shorts and shit. You know, hey man, you know Chris. You know, something on your feet, huh? Chris be trying to be sexy out here, man. He be trying. He out here trying oh, to be sexy. Oh, that's what it is. Yeah. Oh, okay. He out here trying. Ain't nothing to wrong with that, man. Ain't nothing wrong with that, Chris. Ain't nothing, nah, ain't nothing wrong with that. Definitely that, bro. Hey, yeah, Chief. Yeah, man. So um, what's so on your mind, man? Track? I'm gonna let you start it off this week. What's on your mind? Well done. Ask me that, right? Uh -huh. But this is what I'm gonna ask you. Okay. You ask me what's been up with me. What the fuck been up with you? Hey, boy. Uh, I heard you've been going through some. Well, I heard you've been rumbling in the jungle. Yeah, man. The damn blue ninjas, man. You've been rumbling. You've been rumbling in the jungle. 
man, them damn blue ninjas been all over me, man. They done took all my money. I'm telling you, man. They done jumped out on me twice. Then took my money two times, Chief. I don't know about that. Man, I've been all week. I, I'm back in the I'm back in business today, though, man. I got my I got my license back, man. Hair was nappy as hell on the picture. It looked like a damn mud shot, but who cares, man? I ain't got no money for no damn hair cut now. So I'm gonna tell you something, man. When you and Knox let your hair grow out, man, I be I be trying to find motherfucking nine one one and call to put a uh, barbershop alert out on y'all. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> really? You see that Knox? You see your man swinging on your Knox? DJ, my DJ, yo DJ, everybody DJ, go by the name of DJ. Nah. Uh, yeah. The man, hey, hey, that's fine, right, man. I got a nephew. He a barber. He gonna take care of me either tomorrow or the next day. On the low, obviously. Because them blue ninjas yeah. took all my money, man. They jumped out on me twice. Uh man, I, I'm starting okay. to believe they follow me, man. Okay, and I'm still on that, man. Look at this. Look, get you a can that, just go get you a can of that blue magic, right? Right. Get a can of blue magic and get you a butter knife and just start scraping off. Nah, you nah, know? man. Nah, man. <laughs> nah, nah, homie. I got flowing locks, man. I got flowing locks, man. Oh, you got locks? Nah, nah. Oh, I, I'm talking about my hair. My hair too smooth for that, man. My hair too smooth oh. for that shit. Oh, okay. That, that's what's up. That's what's up. I got what the people uh, like down it. south used to call good hair, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. You ain't talking about the ones that uh, I seen out there the other day on the warning picture and shit, man. It looked like they ain't uh, brush, comb, or pick their hair and did. Okay, I see. Oh, no, that's how I look, but <laughs> 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 it's just kind of wavy. <laughs> That's exactly how I look. But the hair oh, just so kind of wave. So you got some of that Gentile in you? Yeah, yeah, I got a little bit in there, man. No, no, no. no. Hey, hey, Chief, check it out. Check it out. Now, I got some Indian in my family. Yeah. I got some Indian in my family. Oh, you got Indian? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Remember back in the day, that was everybody go to line. Uh, my, my grandmama got okay. some Indian in there. Yeah, yeah, I'm Cherokee. No, I'm Apache. <laughs> no, no, motherfucker. The Jaskin. <laughs> exactly. The Jaskin. Uh, it was yeah, always man. I was a mixed. You mixed yeah, up. You mix, yeah. yeah, you mix, yeah, yeah. I see a little, uh, I see a little yellow in you. <laughs> right. <laughs> Straight coward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know how that be, man. But you know where age rap man, this shit started, right? Um, hey man, a lot of people don't take this shit serious, right here, man. Okay. You know, uh. You know, ever since um, I moved down here, I brought some of my northern roots down here 21 years ago. Okay. You know, ever since I moved down here, man, I normally like to get my meat from the butcher. Oh, uh, you know what? No, no, hey, Chief, you started off in the middle of the conversation, man. You started off in the middle of the conversation. Uh, okay. okay, let's, well, okay, let's yeah, start from the top. Tell me where conversation start. Okay. okay. Hey, we want the people to understand, man. We ain't just gonna be talking crazy on the show and cracking jokes and everything. We gonna we gonna try to offer y'all some things to make y'all better people in regards to health, and help mental health and physical health. And uh, right. what me and Chief Rocker was talking, say, what me and Chief Rocker was doing earlier, we was talking about healthier ways to eat and things of that nature. And we found this guy online. The Minister of Fitness, and I'll give y'all his, uh, uh, let me see, let me look it up right now. I had it wrote down in my notes. One second, Chief. It is the Minister. Oh, yeah, yeah, you, you got to keep it. Do you put it on toilet tissue or do you put it on uh, a piece of paper? I put it on old notebook paper from 1988. 30-year-old notebook paper. I got my girl. I got DJ Nunu in the building. Thank you for the support, man. Love to you. Much respect. Vegas. Straight out of Las no, Vegas, no. DJ New New taking over the universe. Please hit the Abby, follow her so you can get some good music and relax your mind after a long, stressful day. 
But like me and Chief was saying, we're trying to offer people, you know, we're trying to add a service to the community. 